4396 excursion. I think this floor plan almost looks like another one that we saw today, I think. We got a corner lot, which is nice. Good size yard. Neighborhood is great, in my opinion. All right, we'll head in. One thing to keep in mind is if you think a home's great, so do other people. So the one on sale wind, if you like that one, assume a dozen, not a dozen, but five, six, seven other people do as well. So we can talk more about the ways the right offer is they had the best chance of getting it accepted and how to win in a multiple offer situation and all that. Cause there is a strategy to it. It's not just give the most money and you win the home. Although that is definitely part of it because money does speak loud, but there's also ways to write contracts as well. I mean, on this home carpet is a little bit older and you can see Little floor damage there. It's like vinyl windows. Take a quick step out to the back. Looks like they replaced some of the fencing. That might have been a sump pump at some point. Sprinkler system. So a pretty good sized yard. I mean, pretty big, definitely. And the side yard. Yeah, it's got AC. All right, so we'll continue through the inside. Little peeling going on there. Little nook. <laughs> Probably gonna be a half bath. Yep. I'll turn this light off for whoever left it on. Got the half bath, the kitchen area, the garage. Pretty good sized garage. I'd say standard two car, maybe a touch wider than most two cars. Left with some paint. Coat closet, which is pretty handy, right off the back door. All right, so that's the main level. Might as well peek into the basement. This looks pretty good down here. Once again, carpet needs a little stretching. Okay, they're doing a radon test down here. Which is good. Good to know if there's radon or not. Got the furnace. Looks possibly original. So, I mean, still not all that old compared to some furnaces. Water heater looks a little newer, but I don't see a sticker on it. Okay, this bathroom's updated. It's pretty nice. Super nice. Laundry room. And then a guest bedroom. Okay, it's a pretty nice home. Pretty nice basement setup. It was like um, laminate flooring. So I'll take you back through the basement, then we'll head upstairs. Alright, so back to the living room. Dining area over there by the light. 
And the stairs heading up. I like need a new toilet seat. <laughs> Got the master with the full master bath. A lot of bathrooms in his home. His windows look in decent condition. Obviously they're not brand new, but definitely serviceable. Our carpet has some stains. So that's our theme throughout the whole house is carpet and just little odds and ends. And that window looks like it seals broken. Once again, at this price point, there are going to be a few different things here and there that might need a little bit of work. I guess I'm going to rephrase that for a house at this size, at this price point. This is a really big house and it's priced lower than it could be if things were fixed up in the home. Alright, so that's the home. I will get this uploaded.